it's Christina Ricci. If you want more pars and you really struggle with an over-the-top move, you just can't seem to get your pressure moving to your lead side at the right time, then use the link below and get this awesome pressure plate. This is really cool. It's designed to help you transfer your pressure from the back side to the lead side efficiently. All right, so it has handy-dandy target line because it's designed to get 70% on the lead side and if you don't it won't press down which is really cool all right so it's designed specifically to help you efficiently transfer pressure from back to front it's really awesome let me show you how it's done all right so if you really struggle with getting your lower body to kick into gear all right go ahead and head to the link below and get this awesome pressure plate designed by Y Golf all right, it's designed to help you feel your weight transfer. So it's set up, you want it pretty balanced. As you move into your backswing, it's going to tilt to the left. And as you move into your downswing, you need to put at least 70% before it moves into the ground. So in other words, if you get to the top and you don't move your pressure and say you spin back, the board doesn't press down. It's designed to move if you put 70% down there. If you don't put 70%, it won't move down, which is what I like. All right, so say you get to the top and you only move 50, it's not gonna move down. All right, so it gives you really, really good feedback. And this is just a great way, at home or at the range, to really groove your pressure. Because a lot of players don't move their pressure in time or move it at all, and that's where over the top comes from. All right, so you're not engaging or using the ground. So a great drill is to place the club on your hips. I do this with my campers. Hip hinge, all right, so make sure you hip hinge so you engage your butt and your core right out of the gate. And then just crack the knees. And then from here, push your hips back and then stay deep with the butt, making sure you push into the ground. So if you get your butt deep, this is the butt move, boom, boom, the ground pressure should be easy. All right, if you don't, the board won't move. All right, so hip hinge, get your butt deep, stay deep, and then turn through. All right, there is, you definitely have to put pressure on the lead side to make this thing drop, all right, which is really cool. Now, I don't like hitting balls off of this because you're way elevated. So this is, to me, something you do to get the feel of it, but you don't hit balls here. But you can certainly make a little golf swing just to get the vibe and it just really helps you with pressure. Definitely get this and make it part of your practice routine.